Hello and welcome to Knowledge Bar. My name is Jerry and this is Windows 8. Let's spend a couple of minutes talking about how we can personalize the start page to be more like the bulletin board that we want to have. So, I'm going to be using both a combination of both finger gestures and using a mouse. And one of the first things I can make a decision on is that I've already downloaded Windows Live Mail from Windows Live Essential. So I don't really want to use the mail package that comes with uh, the Windows 8 base package. So I can go ahead and I can tap it and pull and highlight it and this gives me a sub-menu that says I can now unpin this from the start. And so I removed it. I can also make a decision to say, well, I want to move something, so let's take this mail package and I can grab it, highlight, pull it over, and put it in a separate line. I can do that with a mouse as well. Let's say I want to go ahead and move all of the Microsoft Office packages in the same line for my productivity uh, column, let's say, and I can go ahead and I can right-click and pull my PowerPoint next to it or in another column over here and pull my Microsoft Excel, highlight it, and pull it over here next to it and once again I can go ahead and grab my Microsoft Word once again and pull it over manually like so. So I've gone ahead and I've got the mail package here, I've got my Microsoft Office packages in here. Let's say I want to go ahead and I've got some games that I'd rather have in a different column. So again I can go ahead, highlight, and pull those over in here and once again highlight and pull it over here. If you notice, I'm starting to uh, shift the screen. If I were to continue making different groups off to the, uh, the right here, I'd be able to go ahead and slide over to see them fully if I were to make continued lists. I can also make the screen a little bit smaller so I can more easily see the list. Also, while I'm here in, in, the, uh, in miniature mode, I can go ahead and highlight a particular group, and I can give it a name. So I can go ahead and I'll make this the, uh, I'll make this the, uh, the Microsoft Office one. So I can say, Office. And so now I have a list and when I make it bigger and it says Microsoft Office up at the top here. And finally, let's say I want to change the base background color. I can go ahead and I can pull up the charms list and this is going to be under settings and under change PC settings. This is also a quick uh, clue that this is a fully activated copy because normally you can't modify the start screen if it was not an activated copy. And I'll go ahead and I can say change the background color, put a little uh, decoration around the edge, and oh, yeah, that's more like it. Anyways, for more information, please come on into a Micro Center and see it for yourself. Thanks a lot.